one of the things I wanted to say is this, Brother Rob, um, is is let's talk about the master IT and how you are helping people get into this game. When you first started the company, mm-hmm. you, 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 it was slow. You, you put in the time, the effort, and you made it grow. What are your students like? What are you helping them with? Let's give the people in the audience some things that they need to, if they, because we got a lot of people that come to this channel and they want to right. talk about, or they want to hear about how they can make this change, right? How they can get into IT, how they can become part of the future. How can they not be replaced by automation? How can they get out of their retail jobs or the healthcare jobs because it's unsafe? Talk about how Master IT can help with that and the type of people that you've seen along the way that's getting into IT. I want you to hit on that, man. So uh, recently, uh, we've had an influx of truck drivers and um, nurses uh, or people that's in the medical field. Mm. Um, The type of student, it's kind of hard to drill down because I've had all types of people. Uh, my youngest student was 17. My oldest student was in his 60s, mm. right? Um, and what I found over the years is that um, with the right amount of determination and with the right amount of drive, anybody can make it happen. Because um, I've had students, I actually have two students uh, currently that have um, Tourette syndrome, right? Mm. Um, if you don't know what that is, it's. Uh, uh, I don't know if it's called a disease. I don't want to call it the wrong thing, but it's a a disability uh, may be a better way to describe it. But we have involuntary, you know, maybe you say something or maybe you have certain movements. And um, one of my students, she's actually on her pathway to getting um, A plus. She already got uh, her first certification and then she's getting um, a certification called A plus. And A plus is um, usually the first certification that uh, people go for. Um, And I'm not really a salesman. Uh, to be honest, but I can just tell you what the program encompasses. So it gets you ready for um, four certifications. Um, it has eight courses inside of it. Those four certifications are ITF plus, A plus, Net plus, and Security plus. And Security plus is actually the number one uh, certification for the Department of Defense. And the good thing about certifications is that um, there aren't that many barriers. Is it? It isn't expensive, and it isn't that time consuming. Um, so for me, with tech, I'm a little bit more towards certifications as opposed to degrees. But if you want to get a degree and rock out on tech, that's not the wrong thing to do. But if time and bang for your buck is what you're looking for, I will go for certifications. And this isn't just some guy that just got his high school, high school diploma and hey, degrees. I actually have my master's uh, or well, an MBA um, in technology. Um, so it's not that I hate, you know, I have one as well, but another thing, uh, that was kind of just a check in a block, uh, just to be somebody in my family that had, um, an MBA, mm-hmm. but, um, as far as getting money, certifications can literally change your life. So I've had people that's making $15 an hour, then a year or two later, they're making 70, 80. I had people that, you know, are uh, making $20 an hour and then maybe a year or two later, they're making 60, 70. But one thing I will say is, um, the hundred thousand uh, dollar or six figures always. Oh, I want to make six figures. I want to make six figures. When you don't even make half of that, uh, when nobody in your family has ever made that, mm. technology will afford you that uh, ability or that opportunity. I'm not saying that as soon as you get these certifications, you're gonna make six figures, but you'll have the ability and you'll have the trajectory to make uh, six figures. Mm. Um, so um, the program, like I said, includes courses. Um, It includes accountability, coaching and mentorship from me uh, directly. It also includes a community of other people that's getting it in. So if you um, if you're looking for training, um, the self pace, uh, something that you can do remotely. Um, I got people that I got truck drivers that's literally on the road. And when they at the pit stops, I guess you would call it, they hop on the computer and knock out their courses. So um, it's worked for thousands of students. And, you know, if you're looking for something, I think it'll work for you, too. That's what's up. That that see that that is what's up. That is what's up. And we're gonna unpack this a little bit too, uh, 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 brother Rob, because you know I love I love the fact that this gives people and and, and you said that one of the most important things is this that you said. Uh, you know when I look at the the um, the the analytics for this channel, 
Mm-hmm. A lot of the folks that are that watch this channel are age 24 to 35, right? Uh, so, so the 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 ones and and just before that, something uh, the the 24, 17 to 24 as well, because you're looking to make a decision on going to school, right? But I also have uh, folks that are uh, up to 35 and you know 44 that watch this channel as well too. So I got a I got a pretty dynamic group of people, and one of the things is when I am coaching somebody who's younger, I do steer them more towards the you know, the educational path. And the reason why I do that is because, you know, I work for corporations, right? And and a lot of the times in these corporations, you know, even to to get your foot in the door, a lot of the times they're still demanding you to have some sort of education, right? But Mm -hmm. one thing I love that you said was time. And there's people, right, that, um, you know, are 38, 44, maybe they have a degree or they don't have a degree, right? There's programs out there like WGU where they can get a degree in six months, right? But let's just say, I don't want to do that. I don't want to do any of the the, the educational stuff because I don't have the time, right? I want to make this happen with the 15, all I have is 15 years left to work and I'm not going to spend, you know, four years going to institution and I'm not going to spend another, you know, uh, year going to another institution. I want to get certified in order for me to get into this workforce. And that's what certifications allow for you to do. It allows for yep. you to get certified in a certain amount of time. And that's where I want you to hit on too, brother Rob eventually is how long does it take to get some of these certifications? And I want you to drill into the different types of certifications that you are. Cause I know you mentioned a plus security plus and, and so forth. A lot of people don't know what those terminology or that terminology is. So I want you to hit on that, but guys, a good way to get into IT is through certifications, right? We have brother Rob, who is an expert in this, who's been in the military that's, you know, served this country over eight years, has been doing this the majority of his career, has been in IT the majority of his career, and he's giving you guys a game not just on how to get certified, but how to build your character, how to be a, a high-value man, how to build a business, right? Um, uh, this is a brother right here that I go to for help. This is a brother right here that I have access to and pick up the phone and be like, Rob, I'm coming to Houston. Uh, I need some advice. I want to go this route because you did this before. Give me some advice. A brother that I hold very close to my heart, and I just met Rob maybe about two to three months ago, right? And right. That's, that's, <laughs> you, you know people based on the character what they did in their life, the results. And before you know it, like that's a part of a network. That's a community that you can build. That's how you help each other, right? So I want you to go into the details on the IT part of it, uh, 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 Brother Rob, um, you know, about how long does a certification typically take and then jump into the other uh, types of certifications that that, that your, your your program offer. Got you. So, um how long it takes uh, is kind of dependent on the person. But for my students, uh, most of my students um, get their first certification in 30 days. Mm. So mm. Um, when I was telling you I worked for vocational schools and was a professor at a college for a little while and all this type of stuff, uh, I kind of figured out exactly what students needed, right? Mm. And from my time in the military as well, figured out what students needed um, to not only pass the certification, but actually get the skills that employers were looking for. So um, I'll just use my program as an example. So our program is set up for beginners. Um, So our flagship program is called From Zero to IT Hero. Mm -hmm. So we start with uh, ITF Plus, which is IT uh, Fundamentals, um, and it falls underneath um, a certification organization known as CompTIA. So CompTIA is a, a really big vendor for uh, certifications. I'm a CompTIA partner, which means that uh, CompTIA trusts my curriculum and my training to get you guys uh, certified. So it's not just like I just made this stuff up. Oh, another thing, I'm certified in all this stuff. So any certification that I teach, I'm actually certified in it. I just don't believe in teaching you uh, some shit that I've never done. Mm. Um, so um itf plus is the first one uh usually even though i say 30 days uh recently people have been knocking that out in about two weeks wow. and the whole thing is this right um it's not a race it's not a competition um if it take you 30 days if it take you two months as long as you get the w it is the uh, main purpose but for me uh, and my students um in about four months 
we take you to, you get ITF plus, which I said is just the fundamentals. So super fundamentals. And then A plus would be your next certification that you would get with us. And that's kind of like your high school diploma when it comes to um, IT. Then after that, you would have network plus, which will give you a really good foundation in networking and then security plus, um, which would be a cybersecurity certification. Uh, the reason that I chose these certifications is because um, if you look on Indeed, if you look on Monster, um, there's a lot of job openings for these certifications. And there's a lot of jobs that you can't even get if you don't have these certifications. Mm. So you'll have you know, a leg up on a lot of people having this piece of paper. And uh, honestly, this piece of paper can also make up for experience. Right. So I don't I may not have as much experience, but I got this piece of paper. And then especially in the government sector, you have to have a lot of these certifications to even work on the systems anyway. Mm. Hopefully I explained it, you know, in a, in a good way. You did.